today. Super exciting. I actually have some help for market prepping for the first time ever. It's always just been me making all of these things for my shows and I have a really big one coming up in June. So my husband Peyton is here with me today to help. Hey. <laughs> he's been learning how to crochet this week because he's on his spring break. That's right. So Cameron in the past has tried to teach me to crochet a couple times and it's you know, maybe I can chain one indefinitely. That's how far I got. But recently I've really learned how to do some single crochets and some other really beginner friendly stitches. So mm. I'm definitely not at her level yet, but I've learned some stuff and I'm really excited to help make, I'm thinking we're gonna try to have me make a chicken today. We'll see how that goes. Well, my event coming up is called Farm Chicks and I'm trying to prep as many chickens as possible. So I'm gonna try to get him to help me make some chickens. Now today's video is only possible because of today's sponsor, which is Craftsy, which is how Peyton has been learning how to crochet this week. I have not taught you anything this week. Nope, I may it's have been to, all Craftsy. It's been all Craftsy, but I may give you a couple pointers for the chicken, but we're gonna see how much she already knows and we're gonna see how much we can make together today. Uh, we have a couple hours to sit down and get some market prep done. So we're gonna do that. But first, I just wanna thank our sponsor of today's video because it would not have been possible without them. So a quick word from the sponsor of today's video before we get started, Craftsy. Before we dive into seeing Peyton's crochet skills, I want to thank the sponsor of today's video, which is Craftsy. And if you don't know what Craftsy is, Craftsy is an online community of creative, like-minded makers where members can find endless inspiration, advance their skills, and discover their new favorite hobby. Something that really stuck out to us when we were checking out Craftsy was the community aspect. Members can connect with fellow makers, ask questions, share ideas, and stay inspired. And as a member, you'll be able to access Craftsy live streamed tutorials and Q&As with the experts who teach the classes. The super awesome part is they'll share tips and answer your questions. Craftsy is for creative makers like you and me who want to either learn something new or advance our skills in a certain category. For example, Peyton is just getting started out crocheting and he was actually able to find some really awesome beginner classes and as somebody who I I would say I'm like intermediate to advanced with crocheting at this point. There's also a lot of classes to help me improve my skills with crochet as well. Now Craftsy isn't just about crocheting. Craftsy has over 2000 classes covering a wide range of topics. Yes, crocheting and knitting, but also cooking and cake decorating and even photography and fitness, which I just thought was so cool. Each class goes into depth with step-by-step -step instructions, meaning anyone from any level can jump in and learn new skills. Peyton was looking through the awesome classes that were offered on Craftsy and he ended up taking this class on beginner amigurumi which he learned so much with. You will see in today's video like I am genuinely impressed and if you are interested in joining Craftsy as a member of their awesome community I have a very special offer for you today. The first 1,000 of my subscribers to click the link in the description will get a full year of premium membership to Craftsy for only $1.49. We hope you go check Craftsy out. Peyton and I really enjoyed checking out the classes they have to offer and I think he's definitely gonna use it to improve his crochet skills and I'm gonna go dive back in and not only take crochet classes, but I wanna learn some other things like the photography classes are definitely really interesting to me. And you know what? I'm kinda thinking about learning how to knit. And I just still can't believe how fast Peyton was able to learn how to do amigurumi. I'm genuinely like, Mind blown, you will see in today's video. Again, make sure you click that link in the description if you're interested in doing a full year on Craftsy's premium membership for only $1.49. And I wanna thank Craftsy so much for that super awesome offer that we have. And also just thanks so much for sponsoring today's video. It's sponsors like Craftsy that make videos like this possible. And I really appreciate you checking out the sponsors that we have on the channel as well. I always work with sponsors and brands that I personally love myself and definitely recommend to fellow crocheters. So definitely check them out and I cannot wait for you to see what Peyton was able to learn and him being able to market prep with me in today's video. So let's just get started. So we're really excited to start making some stuff, but of course we do need some coffee first. Maybe you need a chai, we'll see. I think I'm on a coffee kick recently. I don't even know if I'm gonna do a chai to be honest. All right, well, let's go get some coffee together and then we'll head back here and start making. <laughs> okay, we're gonna go grab coffee. We're gonna come back and we're gonna be in market prep mode and we're gonna see how am I, what do I call you? My employee? My husband. <laughs> how my husband does helping me. 
take me forever. Okay. All right. Bye. <laughs>
anyways, little update. That is what his looks like right now. I'm gonna show you. I have been finishing my chickens. So I stuffed one, two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight. I'm working on this one's, I always forget what it's called, the comb. Um, and then I got this one's comb. This one's so cute. So Peyton, this is what we're gonna do to your chicken now. We'll see. Do you wanna finish your own chicken? I feel like that. Oh yeah, definitely. Okay, because I feel like you're you're ready for that. I go live every Wednesday at 2.30 Pacific Standard Time for mm -hmm. Weave In Wednesday over on Instagram. He's, Do I just cut this? Yeah, out? yeah, 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 yeah. Well, leave like a longish tail, but I'm gonna go live and I'm gonna keep working on these chickens and just getting their little combs on them. I'm really yeah. excited to see how it turns out. It's already so good. I'm like genuinely so impressed. It's like, look at this. I can't. I can't believe that. I don't know. I don't know. Comment down below if you think this is pretty impressive. Thanks, Craftsy. <laughs> Craftsy? Like, I didn't teach him the single crochet. I just go, do a single crochet. And then he just started, like, doing it. I'm like, oh, that's awesome. Okay, well, <laughs> see you soon. All right. Okay, so I'm here with Peyton. I've got my chicken. I actually made a chicken in the same color. I really like it. I went live on Instagram. She used some of my yarn. <laughs> You took a nap while I did. I, I fell was, asleep. I was live on Instagram. I thought it was gonna be in the other room. This crocheting really took it out of me. <laughs> Apparently. Here are my chickens that I was able to complete today. We've got one, two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight. Eight chickens all complete back here. They're pretty cute. And then we're gonna add our chickens, sir. There's gonna go one here and you're just gonna move right on top. So the first thing we're gonna do is we're gonna stuff them. So grab some of the polyfill. Yeah, that's good. That's like a good amount. This might be a little bit too much, but that's okay. So what you wanna do is kind of break it up like this. You're gonna have it looking like this. Perfect. We don't need a crochet hook anymore. We need one of these bad boys. Tapestry needle, okay. Should we show both chickens and see if they can guess whose is whose? <laughs> no, yours is really, I am genuinely so impressed with his chicken. So I walked him through, here's mine. I walked him through, okay, here's how to finish it, all the details, embroidered eyes, by the way. So we used this black yarn that we got from earlier and we embroidered the eyes. Do you wanna show your chicken? It's amazing. It is literally so good. And I am so genuinely impressed. I don't, the eyes are a little. They're so cute. It's like the, it's they're like boyfriend and girlfriend. You did such a good job. I'm trying to figure out what this, oh, this wasn't even your fault. This was the yarn. That was, a, that was the yarn defect. That wasn't even his fault. We're gonna shove that in here. You literally, you're so perfect. This is literally perfect. Oh my goodness. I'll put mine up on our stack here and then you can do the honors of placing the last chicken on the chicken tower. I seriously think I can sell that. I'm not kidding you. Like there's nothing wrong with it. It is literally just a cute little chicken, right? Oh my goodness, but I kind of want to keep it because it's special to us now. How long did that take you, you think? Two hours? Two hours, this is his first project ever. This is the first thing you've ever made, right? I've done uh, like, a, like a long chain before. <laughs> okay, this is the first thing you've ever made. Like it doesn't count, okay? Do you think that you're gonna start Maybe crochet. We'll see. You enjoyed it. I thought you would, you were like- I do, I do. He was doing yeah. it. He's like, I'm gonna do this while watching my World War II documentaries. <laughs> uh, we still have some yarn left. You still have some of your yarn left. Yeah, thanks for taking the tag off. That's our video. That was our video. I hope you had fun hanging out with us as we market prep some more chickens for my <laughs> event. Let us know in the comments if you think we should keep it or if we should try to sell it. Okay, well, that was really fun. Thanks again to Craftsy for making today's video possible. I genuinely didn't have to teach you much today. Like you knew how to do the basic stitches. Honestly, I'm genuinely so impressed. I told him how many to do like in each stitch and like doing the increases and decreases, but he knew I was like, do the decrease. And he's like, oh yeah. 
okay, like what? But anyways, that was really fun. Thanks for doing that with me. And thanks for hanging out with us. I hope you enjoyed today's video. Do you want to be on any more YouTube videos in the future? I might pop in some more videos in the future. You know me, I'm not very, I'm just not the same as her, you know? He's a little more introverted, but he still does such a great job. So if you have any more YouTube video ideas that you want Peyton to be in, I was thinking about doing one. He picks out my yarn for the day. He did a pretty good job with this yarn. I really like this yarn. So we can see. But I feel like if I just set you in there alone, the random, like, you always are drawn to the loopy yarn. Yeah. This was a lot of fun. Thanks for hanging out. If you want to keep hanging out with me, I would love to keep hanging out with you. Keep crocheting and uh, marker prepping with you. So I'm going to send you to this video right here. And until next week, I will see you here in this video. Bye. See ya.